for juvenile Huntington's disease, I didn't really know what to do to help the kids. The Food and Drug Administration had told us that we needed to treat adult patients first, and we've been working very hard uh, toward that goal. And the the kids are kids with juvenile Huntington's disease are especially heartbreaking. It's um, devastating. Um, and we started over the last couple of years. We uh, hired an amazing young scientist, Kyle Fink, and he is really focused focused half of our team on working specifically in juvenile Huntington's disease, uh, trying to understand the different mutations, um, the expansions that the children might have, and then to go in and use gene editing to remove the extra uh, DNA repeats that cause the Huntington's disease. And so. It's um, my thoughts on Huntington's disease and juvenile Huntington's disease are that we want to develop treatments, we want to do something to try to help um, the community and our loved ones who have this um, disease. And I wear my uh, juvenile HD bracelet every day, uh, made by Daisy, and I wear my adult HD bracelet every day, made by one of our uh, adult HD patients. And uh, just uh, think about the community pretty much every minute of every day when I look at my and <laughs> um, each parent with Huntington's um, will have one gene that has the, the expanded uh, repeats, their uh, CAG repeats in the DNA, expanded repeats, and then they'll have a copy that does not have the repeats. The repeats cause the disease, and it, it's dominant, unfortunately, if you have a chromosome that has that expansion in the DNA. It makes a protein that really mucks up the neurons, um, they get these inclusions, they're attacked by the immune system, and they die. Um, so there's a 50-50 chance that um, that uh, chromosome that carries HD would go to a child, or uh, maybe the, the unaffected chromosome would go. So 50-50 that um, the children would inherit that chromosome. The juvenile Huntington's disease um, most often happens when that repeat gets longer. and that means as the chromosome is getting duplicated, um, the repeats are expanding. And it doesn't happen very often, that's why juvenile HD is uh, very rare, but um, the consequences are devastating when it does.